After the drama of Thursday night against Inter Milan, Celtic hosted Hamilton Academical in the Premiership. Will have emotionally taken a lot out of Celtic against Milan. It's a good ball in from Commons, and the header was from near beat on, got the final touch. Good save by McGovern. Beat on. Now Brown. Ambrose offers himself on the right hand side. FA Ambrose swings it in. It goes all the way to Forrest. Second effort, too. And Hamilton are able to clear their lines. Well, James Forrest has had his injury problems again this season. Just the one goal. Commons is corner. Denier was front post. Forrest. Looking to go round the outside of Crawford and Gordon. Then turns back and it's beat on. And it's deflected off Hendry. And will go out for the corner kick. Beat on has had a couple of sightings of goal. Doesn't score too many. Denier. Into Brown. Celtic have won their last nine games domestically. This is Ambrose. Great ball in. Johansson sniffing around the six yard line. Gordon in close attention. It's Gudetti. Commons with the run. Now Ambrose. Johansson. Gudetti's in there. Well, Michael Devlin came across. Got the block on the Swede. Crucial intervention. Celtic really pressing here. It's Commons' ball in and Van Dyke with the header. It's been all Celtic. Remember, Hamilton Academical won 1-0 here on the 5th of October. He's a Gires cross, missed by Hendry. Commons now. Still Chris Commons, sets up Gudetti. But still, they can't find a way past Michael McGovern. Celtic have only actually dropped two points here since Hamilton were victorious at the beginning of October. This is Van Dyke striding forward. Break of the ball goes to Chris Commons. And at long last, they have beaten Michael McGovern. And it's Chris Commons on his return. Forrest. Van Dyke dinks that one over the top. Johansson. Well, taking it on the volley as it came over his shoulder. The Norwegian's movement, so impressive, so difficult to pick up. Scott Brown driving on, now releasing Gudetti. Well, he was hoping that that was going to be the moment that he would get it back amongst the league goals. It's been a while. Van Dijk. Izagiri, Celtic in complete control, but they could do with a second goal. Johansson, denied by the post. Beat on, threading it through. Johansson striking it low and hard. Van Dijk given away, but beat on, wins it back for the Dutchman. Virgil van Dijk with a shot, palmed away. Johansson following up, and Celtic have their second goal. It took them 57 minutes to break Hamilton down, and they've now scored two in the space of seven minutes. Van Dijk, Izagiri to Johansson. Stefan Johansson scored that second goal for Celtic. And that's just taken them into the comfort zone. Although there's Van Dijk with the shot, and now Matthews. Well, McGovern probably should have done better with the first save, but the second was brilliant to deny Matthews. Forward from Hendry, here's Hasselbank. Fancies it up against F.A. Ambrose, he's done well here, Nigel Hasselbank. And eventually, a very cool, calm figure of Van Dyke comes in, clears the danger. Crawford's corner. Oh, there's Devlin. Well, really, Hamilton's first and only sighting of goal. Beaton. Aberdeen drew level with Celtic yesterday, but it looks like Celtic will go three points clear, and they're trying to boost their goal difference too. And they have done. And it is John Gudetti 
His first league goal since the 22nd of November here against Dundee. Follows up that goal against Inter Milan on Thursday night. Van Dijk, they're streaming forward now, Celtic. Matthews to Commons. And that is the fourth. Celtic four, Hamilton nil.